Snod's Christmas came early to Goodison Park on Saturday. It was an emphatic win, wasn't it? Yeah, it was an emphatic win. Uh, it weren't the best we played, to be quite honest. We've been playing really, really well. The Derby game was exceptional. Then we went and beat Stoke, and then we've had two difficult games at Old Trafford and the Emirates, and come back with four points from two difficult games. So uh, I think the supporters were expecting a comfortable victory. It looked on paper, uh, and the end result, 4-1, looked a comfortable result. But we didn't play as well as we have been doing, but hey, since the start of the season, who'd have said Everton would have been playing great football, would be in contention for a Champions, Champions League place, and uh, absolutely everybody at Goodison, from the players to the fans, are absolutely buzzing about this season. Well, this is what the top four clubs are able to do, isn't it? Not play their best and still get the results. Well, that's sign of a good team. It really is. You, you hear people say, even when we were playing in the 80s, if you didn't play well and you won, that was sign of a good team. And that certainly is. I'm not saying we, we, were, we were poor against Fulham. We certainly weren't. But we weren't as fluent as we have been in, in recent weeks and a uh, few misplaced passes. But, hey, the final result, 4-1, everybody's gone away happy. We've gained another three points and the momentum's going great at the minute. And another positive, there was four different names on the score sheet. Goals are everywhere, aren't they? That's that good. That's that's a good thing that you're not only relying on Romelu to uh, to score the goals, or if Delafeu play, you're sharing them around. Little Aussie got the first goal, could have had another. He a wonderful volley, just went wide. And uh, Gareth Barry, Seamus Coleman, I played right back for a few years. I don't know what he's even doing up in that 18 yard box at times. But Seamus now uh, has got a few goals. So, no, it's great that they can be shared around, and that's um, a sign of a good team when. when a lot of players are wanting to get into the box and score goals. And just a word on Delafeo there, it was a shame to see him stretch it off. We hope that's not too bad, don't we? Yeah, we hope so. I hope I'm getting a little vibe that he's not as bad as we first thought it were. Obviously, he had to get a stretcher off, and I was feeling the worst, I thought, for probably four to six week injury, but hopefully it'll not. it's not as bad as that. He is an important part of our squad. You can see when he comes on, he lightens the place up, he excites the fans, and uh, he's a terrific little player.